Hello everyone and welcome back to more Stephen and Mal play Super Mario 64. On the last episode, Mal was in control, took us upstairs into Snowman's Land. We got a few stars. A few. And then Mal attempted the 100 coin star. And didn't get it. And didn't didn't get it. But you did get it about halfway. Yeah. It's not terribly bad. Uh, today I'm going to give it a shot. And um, I am just going to kindly ask Dan to bring us in in a little bit. Uh, whenever I've collected a few more coins. Okay, so I'm up here on top of the snowman's head. We have 64 coins so far, and uh, it's been a little crazy, including doing a long jump in front of the snowman, which totally works, but as soon as you do it, he does start blowing, and I had to get out of there quick. I actually, I actually accidentally climbed on top of the penguin's head. I didn't even <laughs> know you could do that. Anyway, now we're up here. Um, we, we can get a, a pretty good view of the level from here, which is nice. Um, so, see, that's where we came from. Over there, I believe, is where the shell is. Yeah, I bet it's in the other block. And I think you get it, and then you surf. Those four red coins, and then there's the ones under the bully. And the one under the bullies, they'll kill you. Uh-huh. We're sure, because there's a sign right next to it that we read, and it was like, Frostbite, seriously, do not go in here, which is basically the game's nice way of saying, we'll kill you, you will die. Um, anyway, yeah. Oh, really thought that I would land that. Um, didn't land that. Also, did the game not respawn these guys? No. Why? I don't know. Can you run up the thing on the left there? I mean, maybe. I mean, there's this guy to give you some health back. I didn't know I hadn't killed him yet. And there's also the little slide thing where some coins are, but I don't know how to get to the top of that. There was a few more up near the fence too. Oh man! Too. Okay, yeah, I can probably, I can probably figure out how to jump up there. Um, this part's confusing though because I always do the the flippy floop. Yeah. There's got to be other ways to get there because like it's Mario and you can do jumps. Yes. But I'm slightly concerned at the moment because like. Oh gosh, Mario, Mario! God, for a second. <laughs> oh my god. Just grab the ledge! Oh my god. Anyway. What was I saying? Um, there. This. Yeah. It's on the other side of this. Jump somehow. up. And then it was like on the other side of the sea. It's over there. That's hard. Um, I bet crawl up like where the ice bridge is and then maybe drop right on the left. Yeah, that's the way they want you to go. I'm going to try and figure out a way to not do that. <laughs> Did that make it? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. yeah. What's right. that? Oh, my God. What? Is there another part to this level I just don't remember? That, to me, looks like something you climb in. We haven't seen the pink bomb bomb. Right? Okay, well, there's a bunch of there's a bunch of coins here. Uh-huh. Crawl I down? I feel like I'm just going to end up falling, but... Well, you got them all. I'm at 73. Uh-huh. Um, and... You have at least four, four five reds, more red? Four... Oh, yeah, there's a few. Uh-huh. I feel like we're actually pretty close to getting 100 coins without going in that igloo. Because when we go in the igloo, again... We may not we come may out. We may not come out. Yeah. Um, dang. I think I'm just going to look around for another minute or two and see if there's something that we're... Like, did we kill this? I think we did, didn't we? Oh, there's two red under there. Yeah. And there's four up on the ridge. That's uh -huh. six. That's um, that's 12. But again, that's still not... That's not 100 coins, so yeah. who knows? We already killed this guy, didn't we? Yeah, we did. Dang. <gasps> you did it! Thanks! Appreciate it. I'm gonna kill this guy. Holy crap. So I killed that thing, and it was making my life really difficult because you're not supposed to kill that thing because that's how you get to the the shell, I guess. But, there was one back there, too. But it wasn't really working. Oh, my God. So here's the thing. Um, I still don't think that there's enough... Uh, coins without going in there? Coins without going in the igloo. I don't even know what's in the igloo. That's the problem. What if there's no coins and we're stuck? Don't know. Just have to risk it, right? Oh my I God. guess so. So should I go after the... Right. Oh. Fart? 
Okay. Well, I'm not going to go after the the two and get the thing then. Yeah. I'm going to. Go I'm going to go in the igloo. <laughs> I don't know what's in the igloo. I don't have a freaking clue what's in the igloo, but I managed to get up here, so I, I feel at least accomplished in that. Mm -hmm. um, but we're going we're going in that igloo, and hopefully it's a solid decision. Hopefully there are coins. I mean, thing is, I'm just I'm just trying to figure out where the coins were, because we. If we got those last two reds, we would only be at, what, uh, 88? Yeah. That, I mean, there's 12 more coins? Where are they? You know? I don't, I don't, they have to be in the igloo. They have to. All right, let's see if I can do this again. <laughs> you can't see. It makes me anxious. <laughs> Well, I mean, you can't fall into the void in this level, and that's, yeah. that's what I care about the most. All right, I have no idea what's in here, but we're going in. Oh, please be coins. Looks like I can also exit, which is nice. What's up, bro? I think we're going to be able to do it. And as a bone... Oh, my God. There's a ton of uh, coins in here. As a bonus, it looks like we may be able to leave, so we can at least attempt the red coins. Yeah. Oh, it's freaking Christmas. <laughs> oh, it's Christmas. I'm feeling good about this right now. Okay, hi. You patrolling? You on patrol, buddy? He's running from you. I think well, I think he's just lost. There you go! Okay, where are all these... There. This is this. To the right. Are they encased in ice? Yeah. They're around the corner, though. Right? Where? No, they're in the ice. Oh. Okay, that's cute, but that... Don't do me no good. <laughs> I need four coins! Oh, there's the, the Bob-omb. You should go talk to him before you... Or exit? Yeah. What, how do I... God. I don't remember this at all. This igloo thing does not ring any bells. I prepared a cannon for you. And then somewhere in the distance that happened. Coins? Coins. Oh my god. Mallory, we need one coin. Well, there's the red coins. Yeah. Was there any, like, that way? Oh. Or back around that corner. There's a vanish cap which helps you get the coins get that the are coins. in the coins, yeah. What the crap is there? Mm -hmm. Because the camp Oh god! <laughs> She's like, I'm coming for you. <laughs> Jesus. Doggone it. I gotta use Mario Cam, which is the worst cam. There it is. <gasps> you did it! Oh my god! That was something, man. Uh -huh. That was freaking something. Holy crap. Okay, and because it does look like it will let us leave, then I am actually going to exit. Hopefully it'll let us. Yep. And then we can at least attempt it again. Um, now, the thing that has to happen to make that work... Is the shell has to be back? Is the shell has to re... I mean, it might reload the enemies because we... Left. Because, we, yeah, we left the map. I don't see any but, of them. Yeah, it looks like it didn't. All right, well, I got up there once... I can do it again, right? Yeah. Oh, God. All right, so we have a problem. Uh, apparently, you only get one shell. Um, it does not reload that shell. And it sucks. Uh, we, you know, change maps by yeah. going into the igloo, and that doesn't matter. Um, there is still no shell coming back. I'm fairly certain that touching that water kills us. But you and, got the hundred coin star. Yeah, I mean, I'm, it's I'm not happy like you didn't at get least. any star. And also, this red coin thing is easy. Uh huh. It's you go get the shell and you get six immediately. So it can be redone. It's not a big deal. It's just a pain because you did all this. We work. did all this work, uh -huh. and here we are. But whatever. Um, I'm trying to think if there's any other way I could get that, and there's there's not. No. Because right. you have to touch it. I'm, what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna long jump to it, so I at least grab one, and I can say that I got them all but one. Oh! Oh, it doesn't kill you! So you think you could grab one and then... It'll give you enough health to I go around gonna, and get the other? I thought it was other? gonna instant kill me. Um... Well, each time you hit your butt, I believe it does three slices. Uh-huh. So, those would only give you two slices. Uh-huh. Um... This is stupid and convoluted, but the... the 
the way to actually survive and do this would probably be to go back into the igloo to get coins. Uh huh. But that's like a lot of time. You yeah. Know? I don't want to spend all my time doing that. The other problem is like, the there's there's that that coin is stuck. Well, couldn't she go where that tree is, and just. Well, I'm just saying you're going to bounce up and you're going to get oh, stuck yeah. into the platform and die. I think I'm doomed. I'll, I'll actually try, but I'm not going to go into the igloo and do all that crap. I'm just going to try and get it. I overshot it the first time. So here's here's how this will work. Um, oh, please. Please don't. <laughs> <laughs> here's, here's the deal. If, if I touch the... If I touch the water, I will die. Uh huh. Because it's gonna do, I think, three. Mm hmm. And if I touch the thing, I will get two health back. So I'm allowed to touch the water once. So it's impossible because it's under. Uh huh. That's why you have to have the shell. Uh huh. So I've, I've lost. There's no way to. That's why fighting this guy is supposed to be such a pain. Except you just, you know, tapped on his face and he died. Yeah. Um. Okay. Well, I'm gonna. You gonna die for it? <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm not gonna do it. You know, it's it's, know, it's impossible. It's, you should try. That scared me. I mean, you're, I'm gonna die in a second, so you shouldn't be too scared. Okay, now I'm dead. <laughs> All right, whatever. At least I'm glad that it's over. 79 stars. I did get the hundred coin star. Passing it back over to Mal. Um, I'm gonna go try and get those. Are you gonna try and do the red coins? Yeah, why not? Okay. So Mal's gonna go get the the turtle shell and we'll see what happens all right Mal, the shell um do you think i should go get these first no no ride the shell to go get them because it's going to make it easier just okay. zoom out your camera and be aware that that stupid snowman is there and uh you can jump and if you run into a wall or an enemy then that'll be bad very good all right you shredding now go for the pond and grab those two that's it you did it Hooray! You have done it. Just don't run into anything, and you can actually shred all the... Oh, okay, never mind. Well... Well, hey, you got it. I'm all you safe. Gotta, all you gotta do is go collect that star. That was fast, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. That was Just uh, pretty fast. Be real careful. <laughs> don't, don't give any enemies any hugs. The hugs stop here. Hey, Holy you want a hug, crap. Snowman? Oh. <laughs> okay. I never jumped it. Dang. Well then. Man, Snowland sucks. <laughs> right? It does. Uh, that's 80. That's two thirds of all the stars in the game. Cool. Woo! Let's come back to this place later. Uh, no. <laughs> no. No. I'm gonna I'm gonna do it because there's only one left, and we already know what it is. Yeah. Um. You're right. So I'm just going to do this real quick because I think I could just shoot to it. Which is weird because the bob bomb is in the igloo, so I don't whatever. Um, I where where's the thing? It's, like it's under his mouth. Oh, I okay. Well, I don't think I can get there from here then. Actually, I, yeah, I can. <gasps> oh, I almost made it. <laughs> <laughs> I was I was pretty impressed. I was like, oh, okay, this is gonna work. Can I do the long jump thing up here? Oh, I was doing triple jumps before and it worked pretty well. I'm running backwards. Goo goo gaga! Back into the igloo to finish this godforsaken level and be done with it. Uh, and I'm doing this basically because we've already seen exactly what to do, and it can go pretty fast. No, no, no. Back this way. Back this way. There. Excuse me, yes. sir. Yes. Go right along the wall. You heard about our Lord and Savior Vanish Cap? <laughs> I swear to God, if I die to this thing in here. Where? How do I get in there? Uh, uh, I don't know. God, this camera really... Oh, do you have to go over yeah, with I her? Yeah, I have to go over. I don't have to go over with her. I'm freaking Mario. I can jump. Uh, all right. So what I gotta do? Can't actually having a fit here. Okay. Well, I can run through ice. I know the general vicinity of what I'm trying to get after. There. Done. Nice. Done. Done. So man land. Done. Holy crap. 81. Feeling good. Don't ever have to go back into this room ever again. <laughs> into the igloo. Hallelujah. Save and continue. And then. Play passes over to Mallory. Good God Is there almighty. anything with these mirrors? Do what? No. Uh, they're actually, they do some interesting things with this room in, um... DS? In... Oh, look at this! This is cute. This is pretty. Uh, yeah, there? in the DS version, there's something something with there. that room with, like, Wario or Let's something? Let's go see what this is. I'll probably hate it. 
Wet Dry World. Shocking arrow lifts. Huh. This is a little pond skater. It's interesting because for whatever reason, this is one of the weirdest but also most iconic Mario levels to me. Ow! Yeah, th that's that little guy. He, he, um, he I wasn't shoot looking. You. But there's water, so you have infinite health. There you go, crossing them, crossing them bridges. What's this? Touch it. Oh! That water's going up and down. So, as a reminder, uh, the name of this star is Shocking Arrow Lifts. So, is what is your interpretation? I don't know, there's arrows. That's a good deduction. You can get up there. You just have to, you probably need to do a side somersault. Perfect! Excellent job. Oh man, a new critter to meet! Critter? Look at that critter. Oh god. He's gotta wind up. Oh god. Now, while that does seem bad... It can give you some... He can also give you some height, so like, uh -huh. you know, it's it's double-edged double -edged sword. What's this do? Oh, there we go. You made stairs! Okay, well, there... <laughs> that was a number. There's apparently some number stuff you have to do. Scared me. <laughs> um, I think... I think that's actually the star you're after. I'm not entirely sure, but I'm, I think so. I think you had to step on that to lower it, so you uh -huh. could... Oh, well, now it's gone. Yeah, I was having trouble with the camera. Um... But I think that's it! Could be another one. I don't know. Some of the ones are just confusing. But uh, there's... This is a great big world to explore. And I don't know why this one seems so iconic to me. Maybe it's because I, I really enjoyed the concept as a, as a kid. And also, it seems really out of place. Um, like, there's Snow World. And there's Underwater World. And there's the bob on Battlefield. Oh, and then you got this, which is some sort of, like... It, lo it looks like someone took all of the scrap stuff from their trip to Home Depot and threw it into a, a lake. And that's what this level is. So if I bring it down... Yeah, there's two sides to that platform from what I could tell. So like when you walk over to the left part, uh -huh. that's the part that goes down. And I think the idea is that you get on it and it lifts you up to the star. So you would have to ride it down. And the thing that would be difficult is that... You, uh, there's water, so you'd have to swim underwater. So maybe this isn't exactly how you do it. Maybe this isn't even the same star. I don't know. Because then you get stuck in the, in the water. But if you swim down, you might be able to do it. How? Ah! Uh... Okay, well. Do I hit this again? Um, the Those icons bring it to wherever the icon is. Oh, so I have to find the one down. Yeah. If you look around, you might be able to... I trying to stand on this. If you look around, you might be able to find it. And actually, you found it. <laughs> so, if you hit that, that will bring the water level down. It's wet-dry world because it is wet and dry. And there's actually a really cool mechanic that I'm not going to tell you about. I'm going to see if maybe you figure it out. Oh, look. Let's hit this. There. Water be gone! Oh, I suppose I should, like, punch this, not push it. So then I'm gonna swim down here and then jump on it, and then it'll bring me up right to the star! I mean... Ooh. I mean, maybe. Let's find out where this blue coins go. To be honest, I don't... I don't know exactly how things are gonna work, but yeah, in theory. In theory, yeah. That's, uh, possible. Having some serious... Just jump! You don't, ha you don't have to ground pound. Yes, I do. You don't. See? You kill it. All right, the ground pound is throwing your, your rhythm later. off a little bit. Uh, okay, 30 coins. Which is pretty great. The other thing about this level is it's actually quite large. Um, yeah, it's feeling really big. Well, you... <laughs> you don't know the half of it. Um, maybe that's why I liked it so much, is that it just, it's such a big, uh, such a big playground. 
swimming. So the other one was up there. Yeah, so your plan is to raise the water again, and then you're going to do the exact same thing and try to swim down, get under the platform, and then... Yeah. I'm not entirely sure that this is, this is how it works. Um, you may still be able to do it, of course. I'm gonna try. Um, but I, the thing Burrow. that the thing that I'm worried about is that the platform is above the hole. Yes. So you're gonna have to swim around the platform to get up to begin with. So that, I think that's, I can do it. You might, yeah, and you might be able to, and maybe that's even how you're supposed to. But I'm not sure. I don't, I don't quite remember. So it'll be interesting to see how you, uh, how you handle it. How I handle it. So. Yeah. It was over here? What are you looking for? The little diamond to make it higher. Oh, um... Turn the camera a little bit. Yeah, you hit a button, and oh. then it's up on that. Yeah. Your poor little butt has probably got third-degree burns. Wah! There it is. Looks good to me. So now That's you're really a nice thing that that you get your health back. Yeah. Yeah, I mean the game would be the game would be difficult otherwise. Um. All right, so it was this thing. I'm 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 curious to see if this is gonna work. I'm I'm very much invested in what you're doing. In my plan here. Yeah, I'm uh, very interested to see if this is gonna work the way you want All right. it to work. Get my camera in a good in spot. Fact, in fact, you don't even have to ride that elevator down. It's coming down, so you could actually just... Speed it down? Like, you could start it and then just... Yeah. And get, like, a heads... Heads up thing. Did I miss it? Yeah, it just went Dang by. it! <laughs> um... Now, here's the thing. Huh. Having seen some of this in action, I don't think this is how you do it. Um, I'm not sure, but I'm all, I also kind of don't think that that's, that's, how you, uh, that's how you're supposed to do it. The other thing, Mal, is that the, the, the level is called Shocking Arrow Lifts, and there's still arrows that point up. Maybe you're supposed to go further up. Okay. I'm not... I, I don't know. I'm not sure. Um, they always fling you backwards. Uh oh. Just uh, FYI. But you can use that to your advantage. You just have to line it up uh, perfectly. A little, a little far away. There's also probably a way to just climb up. Um, probably. Like blocks. Like those. Like this block. Yeah. No. Well, walk around. Around this way? Yeah, see? There's like blocks and stuff. Yeah. I'm sure that there's probably some way... You were leading that fire Some down there. Some way to... Like, oh, can you like, climb up there? Yeah, or? I suppose I could try that. And That's a long jump. I mean, I would have somersaulted from the block, oh, but... yeah. <laughs> you, uh, you gotta remember your repertoire of moves here. Uh, There's a lot of them. Oh, God. Almost there! Oh... Oh boy. There we go, hallelujah. Oh, that's a big guy. That oh, is a big guy. Oh, you are large. He is large. And uh, I can guarantee you he's not happy with you. Nice! Good job, Mal. You got you got the stuff. All right, oh, now health. that you're up here, t uh, move your camera around, see if there's something up here. There's even more stuff. There might be something up here to... Uh, Collect. Maybe this is the way that you're supposed to be going. She's it is called shocking arrow lift, so I'm. That's my thinking is that the arrows were what you're supposed to be following, and this is this is the shocking part. So I think maybe this is right. Get behind me, camera. Camera's like no. Nah. Well then, let's do it this way. Looking good so far. Careful. If you get shocked, it's it's not the end of the world. They shouldn't, like... Oh, God. Nice. Did miss that jump, though. I did. 
Well, you did fall, but the good news is you fell less far. Oh, man. You kind of got double duty there for a second, Mal. All right, you're, you're fine. Just just chill. Just watch out for the fire whenever you get over here. Good save. Uh, no damage there. Back up. All right, Mal's almost there. She jump to that platform. The spinny one? Yeah, because then it then at least you're not on fire. Just chill, just chill, okay. just chill, just chill. Scared me. I know, but you're not gonna fall. You're not gonna fall. You will, however, get sick and puke, but you're not gonna fall. I That's firmly better. believe that there's a star in that box. Okay. You have to jump to the the platform. <laughs> Mario, don't fall. Oh my god. I think I just pooped myself. <laughs> I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I smell a feces. I, hate I think this world I think so I just much already. down my legs. Uh but you did it. Mal. Yeah. You did it. Top of the town. That wasn't even the star. Um <laughs> So God knows Look what how many coins I got. God knows what the shocking arrow lifts one was. Dang. <sighs> uh anyway, that is it for today. Thank you so much for watching. Mal. That was a that was a valiant effort. Yeah. And you got, well, you got a star. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what the shocking arrow lifts one is. We'll figure it out. Um, yeah, that that world is uh, hard. Awful. It is actually. It is. I'll I'll call it awful. Um, and it's very meticulous because of the water levels. Yes. And there's certain times where water levels have to be in a certain place for certain things to happen. So yeah, it's um. It's going to be a fun one. Thanks for watching. See you guys next time for more Stephen Amount Play Super Mario 64.